Hello folks. You know my last challenge accepted was to launch a plane from a quadcopter. And then a fellow made a comment wondering if I could launch a quadcopter from a plane. Well I thought about that a while knowing I would need two pilots and some place with a runway and a quadcopter and a plane and some kind of release and it just seemed a little harder to work out than the other way around. A lot of things that you'd probably not think about you'd have to think about. Well, I decided to try it with my tiny CH-31 Cheerson. You see, it writes itself, and it can be flown in the air. It's got an auto-return button. I asked Jeff to be the quad pilot, and then I decided to use, what, my skipper with lights, as it needs no runway. My launch system is pretty easy, as you're going to see. The first part shows Jeff flying the saucer after launching. We did it several times. In the second part, I did it at night by myself, with four cameras and the lights. I also figured out a trick how to land it. And he's got it! Oh, I gotta get my, where's my plane? There it is. Yeah, he landed right in front of me. Well, after watching these first clips and then looking at the UFO, and uh, I looked at it a little closer and I found that if a person moves the right stick the slightest bit under full power, it works too hard to get level and it won't maintain altitude and comes down faster. So I figured if I could only eliminate the full power, I'm not going to be busy watching my airplane, so I won't have to worry about the right stick and see what would happen. I'm going to attempt to fly it tonight solo using my throttle governor and soft landing theory. I've got four cameras ready to go, including an onboard camera. So here's my idea for flying them both. First I put a piece of tape on the transmitter throttle stick so it's set for just a soft descent and landing. It can't go open very far. That took some trial and error to get just right this afternoon. And how I fly it is I push the throttle open after launching it to the top since I can't see it, you know, busy flying the plane. Then hit the return button. Bingo. Comes right back. So Here we go. what I'm going to do is when it comes out of the airplane, I'm going to punch the throttle up and hit the return button right away. And that's the way it should work. Power on. Return button landing. Recording. Okay. Here we go. I'm going to hit this return button after I get this thing airborne. So. Drop! Three, 